Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are all doing very, very well. If you haven't already guessed by the title, this is gonna be a glow up week for me. So I'm just on my way to go get my hair done. Now I'm gonna insert a picture of what my hair currently looks like as I'm sat here right now. Um, so this is what my hair currently looks like. The ends are dry and a lot lighter than my roots. So I just wanna get that sorted out and let me just insert the inspo picture as well. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going to do today. I can't remember the last time I got my hair done, so I'm actually really excited to get it done. So yeah, I'm getting my hair done and then later on this afternoon, I'm actually going for some lemon bottle fat dissolver. So this is just not, I want this gone basically. I want this like this. 24 seven. So I'm getting my double chin dissolved and then on Wednesday I'm actually getting my nails done. I've been doing my own nails for ages, I'm a qualified nail tech and it's just about time that I went to someone else because I hate doing my nails, that's it, I hate doing my nails. I thought I would just treat myself this week and just get my nails, hair, all that good stuff done. I feel like I probably should have done this at the start of the year. Um, it's now February the 26th, so a bit late to the party of New Year, New Me, but at least I'm getting it done. Anyway, I'm about to go to Lidl because I haven't had any breakfast, I haven't had a coffee or anything. So I'm just gonna go to Lidl's bakery and pick up a pastry. So let's go. I can't, I'm looking at myself in the camera and all I can see is this double chin. Oh my God, really in need of that lemon bottle right now. Right, I have just been into Lidl and I picked up a smoothie. This is a pineapple, melon, mango and passion fruit. And then obviously I picked up a couple pastries. So I got an all butter croissant and I also picked up a pan of chocolate. I'm not gonna eat both now. I'm gonna eat one now whilst I'm driving and then maybe have one later. I don't know how long. I'm gonna be sat in the hairdressing chair for. I think I'm just gonna have the all butter croissant it's gonna make crumbs everywhere in my car and I don't know what to do about it. But I'm just gonna have to deal with it. I am back from my hair appointment and I am so happy with it. Usually I'm so nervous to get my hair done because I'm so picky and I just, seeing change in myself is just like really scary to me basically. But I'm genuinely so happy with this. This is sort of what my natural hair would look like. Maybe the slightest bit lighter, um, but I'm so happy with it. I'm obsessed. I feel like getting your hair done is like the ultimate glow up thing like it just changes your whole look completely so yeah i'm really really happy with it i'm about to go inside the house and just drink loads of water because my appointment is in two hours two and a bit hours um and it's really important to drink water before these sorts of appointments one because it will reduce swelling i don't want to go into work tomorrow with a huge swollen chin and two apparently when it comes to lemon bottle fat dissolver um water is like its best friend and it really helps the results so I want to sort of get the best results I possibly can. I've already drunk so much water today, like I genuinely feel so bloated, but a little bit more water is not going to hurt. So that is the goal for this afternoon, just get as much water in me as I possibly can. And then I'm going to check back in when I'm on my way to the fat dissolve appointment. Um, so yeah, this is just step one of the glow up and I'm already feeling so much better for it. So yeah, what do you guys think of the hair? I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I'm going to try to show you in like better lighting, maybe when I'm inside the house or maybe I'll just film a little clip when I'm outside because no one is actually around. So yeah. So this is the current hair. Um, I feel like the light is actually making it look darker than it is lighter, but I still really, really like it. Guys, I am currently on my way to get the fat dissolver. Um, I've drunk so much water that I never want to touch water again in my bloody life. 
literally within the last hour, I have probably drunk about five or six glasses, which is a lot for me. I don't really drink water. Um, but yeah, let's get rid of this. I hate it so much. I want to have a nice snatched side profile like this, not this. Right, so this is my current side profile. I hate that I'm showing you this because I don't know, I flipping hate it, but just the jawline, I would love for it to be like this and just not what it is. So that's what I'm looking to change today. Um, I'm about to go into the appointment, so let's go. I am out of my appointment and honestly painless like I don't know if I've got a high pain threshold obviously she did give me the choice for numbing cream and I said don't even worry about it so I told her not to worry about numbing cream I was like I'm not fussed um it's just a tiny little needle but this is straight after there's like the tiniest bit of swelling here she also said the whole drinking a load of water helps so much with the results because the dissolved fat comes out in your urine like that is so wild to me how does that even work but yeah i'm gonna continue to keep you guys updated i'm gonna update you guys a bit later on on how i feel and what's going on and yeah i'll update you guys tomorrow 24 hours after i've had it right guys i am literally just turning up to my nail appointment now i haven't checked in with you guys but i have been taking so many pictures of the fat dissolver and um how much it's genuinely worked i'm so impressed with it honestly i cannot believe it um so i'm gonna insert some pictures for you guys um but yeah uh my current nails look like this which is an absolute state honestly they're horrible i just really can't wait for someone else to do my nails rather than doing them myself um so yeah i'm about to go in so this is the before and i will show you guys the after in about an hour's time it has been a week since i got my nails done and i'm really disappointed in myself that i haven't shown you sooner um i also feel like i haven't been updating you on the whole fat dissolver around the face and the hair as well i'm absolutely loving the hair super super happy with it my next step is just to take care of it oil it really make it grow i want this thick brunette luscious natural hair that's the goal and also the fat dissolver i've been taking so many pictures but i've just noticed that the bruise still hasn't gone so i don't know if i told you but um i got a bruise just under my chin there which is obviously expected it's been a week and two days since i got it done i've been drinking insane amounts of water put it that way like my skin is not this clear for no reason. I've been caning the water like it's going out of fashion. It's incredible. I am so proud of myself because I'm not a water drinker at all. But yeah, I've been doing that. I don't know how I'm going to show you the results because my side profile is just... Yeah, not not one of the things i'm most confident about i'm not gonna lie certainly when my hair is not up in a greasy sweaty bun from the gym but i will show you anyway so here goes nothing okay so first of all here is the bruise maybe in some of the pictures that i insert you will see that it's a lot more prominent in the previous pictures than it is now um but it's certainly taking its time to go away a week and two days for a bruise I don't know plus i've been using arnica cream so let me move across so i can insert some pictures so i'm going to walk you through this and i'm going to have to insert the pictures afterwards so 
this is the before this is me sat in my car this is right before i went into my appointment i hate it i hate that there's just no definition to my face whatsoever so that was just one of the things i really wanted to achieve was a more defined jawline and just basically confidence confidence is all i want and the lemon bottle i feel like although it is sort of cheating a little bit um I don't know it's like an assisted weight loss I feel like that's what I'm telling myself anyway this next picture is as soon as I got home um from the appointment you can see that the jawline is already coming and being a lot more defined than the first picture and maybe I'll just pop the pictures next to each other so you can sort of compare um and then this next picture that I'm going to post is in the evening so this was just after sort of a light massage drinking two three liters that day this was how it looked straight after so yeah instantly i was so impressed with the results like they just got to work straight away like i literally couldn't believe it and then this next picture i'm gonna insert is a day later so 24 hours later you can see that the bruise is coming out a little bit more um but the definition is still there so yeah overall i'm genuinely so happy with the results of this when i went in there she said that i had quite a defined face anyway and not from the side i'm telling you i do not from the side have a defined face i feel like a genuine sausage roll from the side but like obviously from the front i've got this sort of quite defined chin so i think that's what she meant because she must have been playing pranks on me if she thought that i had a defined jaw i will have to keep you guys updated over on my instagram so if you don't follow me over there go give me a follow and i'm gonna link who done my nails who done my hair everything like that who done my lemon bottle dissolver in the description box below so make sure you check out their instagrams they're all incredible girls they all made me feel so much better about myself in their own little ways so i am so grateful obviously all of these appointments were completely paid for it's not like they've given me something for free and they've asked me to record as a sort of promo it's not like that at all this is just a video idea that i really wanted to film and take you guys along with me because it's so much fun i literally had the best time last week and yeah i felt so much better about myself so sometimes a little glow up is genuinely needed sometimes you do need to spend a little bit of money to make yourself feel better that's all i'm gonna say moving on i really want to talk about my nails because i can't i've been doing my own nails now for i want to say two or three years maybe on and off going to different nail techs and um all really great girls but it's just not worked out for me i mean my nails are genuinely so so brittle and yeah it's just been really hard like even when i do my own nails i was doing them like once a week at some times because they're just so brittle they peel off everything but these nails were literally perfect i'm gonna have to move over and insert another photo these nails the application the nail art the detailing oh my god i literally just can't like i'm so in love with them i had these nails on for a week can i just say and i want to get them done again not because they're bad but because i just fucking loved it like genuinely getting your nails done is just i was so excited for the appointment i was waiting for it for so long i was naturally trying to grow my nails and when you've got bendy nails and you're trying to get them to grow, oh my god, it's the most disgusting thing. I felt like I couldn't touch anything because my nails were just bending. But yeah, absolutely adore these nails. Adore my hair, adore the lemon bottle. Literally, I've recommended the lemon, lemon bottle dissolver to everyone. Every one of my friends I've recommended it to. And they're like, oh my god, I want to get it done. Like, actually in awe at the results this is your sign to treat yourself book that appointment and make yourself feel better so i'm gonna end the video here thank you guys so much if you have watched to the end it genuinely does mean the world to me i know i've been slacking a little bit when it comes to the youtube content but honestly i feel like i've just been so busy i've recently become much more of a gym girl and i'm kind of loving it so yeah working full time as well as going to the gym four times a week at least as well as maintaining relationships, friendships, seeing your family, 
do you know what just time off social media all that good stuff it's been so difficult for me i genuinely wanted 2024 to be my year and i'm not saying it's not gonna be but i feel like i've just had other things that i needed to prioritize over youtube and yeah that's all that needs to be said really i hope one day i can find my balance between life and youtube but when i'm working full time it's just so hard the youtubers that i watch are youtube full time i mean so yeah that's the goal there's just been so much going on that genuinely i haven't had the time to prioritize youtube and that's the sort of harsh truth of it really but yeah that's all that really needs to be said i'm going to stop rambling on but i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you haven't already subscribe to my youtube channel go follow me on instagram and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up and i can't wait to see you guys in the next video